Yo guys, this is DJ Michael X. Um, I know it's um, bullshit because my original camera is broken, so it looks like crap. My original microphone is broken, so it sounds like crap. Still, I gotta do this because I have to because there is something to discuss and I will want to give my opinion opinion into that. I know. Um, First things first, uh, my English isn't perfect, I'm still learning, but I'll give my best and I'll, uh, I'll hope you understand everything I say, so yeah, just do it, I'll just do it, fuck it. Anyway, uh, it's because of the Tekken 7 thing going around here, uh, from the main man, sweet, I uh, hope um, I didn't uh, pronounce it uh, the wrong way, but Oh, you probably will be fine. So, yeah. The thing is, um, it's kind of difficult, you know, because Tekken Seven, there's almost like nothing but only this trailer, and it's like what short trailer and the long version. And it's like 20 times in YouTube, always another name, but always the same stuff. And I'm always waiting for some new stuff, you know. I'll just, I'll just uh, like the Tekken 7 fan page, and they're showing kind of like pictures from the characters, some new designs, and I like it. It's very cool. But um, because of the Tekken 7 story, well, I think the main man's right because they kind of destroyed uh, Kazuya's character because he was. In the end, he's 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 the good guy, but um, he always was this this uh, bad guy because he had this devil gen and this devil powers, and he was kind of this badass, you know. And in the end, like he's like crying because, hey, how did you kill my mother? But the first thing what happened was like, uh, or uh, throw son son into a volcano or something like that. Then the sun is redoing the favor, and they just do it like it will be some kind of party or something like that. Well, um, you uh, said that it could be Hey Haji uh, Jim Paji. I'm sorry, Jim Paji, the guy uh, standing behind Kazumi, and that also could be right because of what happened in Tekken Five. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, just watch his video. He's probably right there. But the thing is, there are so many other things that should feel fit in it, but they just are not there. And I don't know why, because they should be there already if they showed this much of information for Tekken 7. Um, things like, um, you see, they're always talking about Kazuya Heihaji. And, and Kazumi, but they're forgetting, they're forgetting Lars, they're forgetting Azuka, they're forgetting Jun and Jin, and they have a very, very important part in this story and game, you know, because um, Jun is always like the peacekeeper, like the the, the good girl in, 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 in this game, because uh, as soon as you turn into a level or something bad, she's always there to heal you. Like it happened like in the movie, in the movie, in the OVA, to Kazuya, or in Tech and Tech Tournament 1. I know it's non-canon, but still when he was devil Kazuya, she somehow healed him. I think that that happened to Delgin as well. And in the end, and, and scene of, of Jin's Tekken, I think it's Tekken, yeah, it's Tekken 4, when he almost killed Heihaji, and then he saw this, this statue, and saw kind of his mother in it, and, yeah, right now, like, in Tekken Deck Tournament 2, what happened there, when, when, when he got pissed off, because, because, um, Jun actually got killed by him, or something like that, and then he was, like, pissed off, like, I found my mother, but now, I killed her, and, and in the end, she healed him again. She, she, yeah, she healed him again. But for those who don't know, and it kind of pisses me off because it's not only non-canon, 
is the same story and Harada already talked about it. June is not officially unknown. That's not true. They just did it because they needed some story in Tekken Detriment 2. They, they just needed a bond, you know, a connection between June and Unknown. And they they had the same moveset, the same... Um, they all... everything was the same. Everything was the same. It's, it was like... it's like... Uh, June is June in, in her good form and Unknown is her devil form. But that's not it. June is not unknown. Even even Harada Sam said June unknown was supposed to be June's sister. But yeah, Harada Sam was like, well it's non canon and I need the story, so I'll change it quickly, I don't give a fuck. Let's be June unknown and unknown June. So all these guys will be satisfied and they'll be okay with it. But the truth is the truth is that he said it himself. June is not unknown. She was supposed to be her sister, but they they were like, well, that's too much story for a non-canon game, so we'll just do it like that. Anyway, um, where was I? Um, yeah, because all of these are family members. Uh, to be honest, I don't like Lars. Um, he was like, he's a good design character. And a good playbook character for other guys, but for me, I can't. I somehow can't play with Lars. I don't know why, but there are some awesome Lars fighters out there. Um, respect, but um, I just can't count him as a part of the um, Mishima and Kazama family. Well, there are some elements if you play through the the arcade story, the story mode of Tekken Seven. But he he's not original. Like he's something like Lee, you know. Like I'm I'm the son of a Haji, but still I'm not a Mishima and things like that. I just I just don't like it. It's not like I hate him, but I don't like him as a part of this family. He's like uh, like the lost son or something like that, you know. But um. The other thing is, um, Harada-san said that Jun is going to be officially in Tekken 7, and that was, I think it was on the release day of, of Tekken Tech Tournament 2 or something like that. It was an interview, and he said that, that Jun is going to be in Tekken 7. So, there is, in this trailer, you see Kazuya, you see Heihaji, you even see Kazumi, and maybe you see Jim Paji as well. It's, it's not confirmed, so I, just, I don't want to talk about rumors, but where the fuck are Jin and Jun? I mean, all of you guys are talking right now like Kazuya has always been the good guy, but when you start Tekken 7, you kind of think like Kazuya is the bad guy, and you don't give a fuck about Hey Haji to be honest, but if you... Um, I just played it through right now, Tekken 2, and... If you watch Kazuya's Tekken 2 video ending ending scene, you'll see that he uses a Haji as a shield to defend himself against who? Devil. So in Tekken 7, and in the end he beats him. So in Tekken 7. Kazuya and Devil are two separate characters, and wasn't it made like that then the guy who actually wins the tournament, uh, well, that guy has the price of the true ending scene, like in Tekken 4, Jin won, and in Tekken 5 you know that the ending of Jin's ending is the true ending, as well as in Tekken 5. Jin won, and in Tekken 6 you know that Jin's ending is the true ending. I don't know the connection between Tekken 3 or and 4 this good, but I think that that's the same as well. So, if Kazuya's ending in Tekken 2 is the true ending, 
then I don't get this connection between Kazuya and 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 Devil. And after watching Kazuya sending in Tekken 4, it looked like the Devil, like um, he he took over. Like now Kazuya, I've got your buddy. Now you can do nothing about it and shit like that. I'm your master now. I'll write you shit like that. You know. Like what the fuck? I I just don't get it. I don't get it. If you if you want if you want a, a special story just between Kazuya and Ayaji, then do it, no problem. But if you want to to end the whole Tekken story, then you have to bring in the whole family, and you finally have to clear it up because Tekken Six, that's where that's where it ends, because Tekken Tech Tournament Two is non canon as well. Wasn't Azazel the the father of the Devil Jin? And didn't he say something like, when you two don't die, and that Jin and Kazuya because they got the Devil Jin as well, then I can die as well. So that means he must be still alive. And that may be, but I don't think they're gonna do it. But it shall be if the shit Azazel said is true. Then he probably should be in Tekken 7 as well, because he did not die. Because Jin and Kasturia are still alive. Man, that's complicated. And, you know, Jun, Jun was, you, you have to Google it. Google Jun and Unknown Story. There will be something someone did and it's fan made, but it's fucking realistic. It's fucking realistic. And this story, this fan-made story, tells you, but I don't know how much truth is behind that, what happened to June after Tekken 2. Because she died in the hands of Uber or True Uber and Jin wants revenge. Well, why is she back then? Why did Harada-san say that she will back in, be back in Tekken 7? I think there will probably be some kind of new Dragon Balls or something like that, but I don't know. Well, um, we'll see, we'll see. Hmm. It's complicated, right? Well, tell me what you think about it. And don't forget, don't forget Azazel, don't forget Jin, don't forget Flowers, don't forget Kazuya. Uh, Kazuya, I mean June. And you know who I forgot as well, Azuka. What's with her? I know she's a Kazama, but just fighting against Lily, I mean, that's pointless. She should be a part of the family because she's a Kazama as well, so bring her into that story. Tell me something if you know. It should bring her into that story, except that Jin was on her tits. And, yeah. I don't know. You killed my mother, and now I want revenge, and then, hey, I just kind of cry. That's cool for me, but... It just don't... Fits in the story, in the in the usual story from Tekken One to Tekken Six. It it just don't fit. So, if you got something, if you got something, I don't know. Just tell me. Just comment, and I'll be happy if the main man does, and this other guy is like, this is the true story, and you put it in the dirt, you dropped it into the whatever. What the fuck, man? Just shut the fuck up, come on, it's his opinion, and where are we? We're in YouTube, so everybody has his own opinion, and he's a free man, so what the fuck are you yelling about? If you don't like it, don't watch it, don't respond to it, just be a man if you are, and fuck it. And thanks, and see ya, and goodbye, and work. Taking rules.